Hi everybody, welcome to my YouTube channel Dr. Srinivas Medical Concepts and my FB page Dr. Srinivas Concepts. This is Dr. Srinivas, Neurologist from Rajmandri, Andhra Pradesh, India. My email is sriklpm at gmail.com. I am the medical author of the books Focus Neurology and Exam Oriented Clinical Neurology. Today we are going to talk about a very very important topic flare fluid attenuated inversion recovery sequence flare fluid attenuated inversion recovery sequence neuroimaging concepts part 9 flare fluid attenuated inversion recovery sequence this is probably the most popular sequence used by radiologists and neurologists to interpret various neurological disorder this is probably the most popular sequence of MRI for radiologists and neurologists to interpret various neurological lesions. But what exactly is flare? What is this fluid attenuated inversion recovery sequence? RF pulses can be applied to T1 and T2 weighted images in order to selectively suppress signal from fluid or fat. Fluid means we are talking about CSF. So FLAR, Fluid Attenuated Inversion Recovery Sequence is a T2 weighted sequence. So you remember that T2, the CSF is bright. So Fluid Attenuated Inversion Recovery Sequence, FLAR, is a T2 weighted sequence in which the bright signal of fluid that is not contained within tissues is suppressed. So the CSF signal is suppressed instead of bright it appears dark so this is particularly useful sequence for visualizing lesions located near csf compartments since csf signal is suppressed and appears dark the the lesions appearing around csf there's a good contrast and can be well visualized so if you can see this image you'll be able to appreciate it better so this is the normal t2 wherein the CSF you can see it is bright the gray matter is bright or hyper intense but the white matter is dark or hypo intense or black so this is the T2 sequence flare is also similar to the T2 sequence but the CSF which appears bright here it has been suppressed and they have become black so you can see the CSF is black the other the other the gray matter and the white matter the signals are the same so here you can see the gray matter which appears bright here it also appears bright here the white matter which appears dark here in t2 it, it also appears dark on flare except that csf csf is bright on t2 but it has been suppressed to produce a dark image so that the lesions can be well visualized so small area of edema or hyper intense due to cortical vein thrombus because of this contrast this is black so it is appears it is well seen here here it is not that well seen because both both appear white so since the csf is dark here this is well appreciated so this is the advantage of t2 flare but how do we differentiate flare versus t1 in flare the csf appears black on T1 also the CSF appears black. So how do we differentiate? In T1 it is the normal color code that is the gray matter is gray or dark and the white matter is white or bright but in flare though the CSF is dark the gray matter is white and the white matter is black because it is actually a T2 sequence wherein the CSF signal is suppressed. So by looking at the gray matter and the white matter we can differentiate whether it is a flare or T1 though both though in both the CSF is dark. So here you can see the gray matter is brighter than white matter but here the white matter is brighter than gray matter but in both the CSF is dark. So this is the way to differentiate between the flare which is a T2 sequence but the CSF signals are suppressed and T1 because the confusion may arise because in both the CSF appears dark.
the other important concepts of neurology especially the clinical neurology i have put in a book called exam oriented clinical neurology which will be very useful for students appearing for clinical neurology exams so if interested this book could be purchased the other book i've written is focused neurology written by me dr s srinivas this book is published by cbs publishers and distributors this book contains all neurology concepts in a question and answer format and this book is available online from all leading booksellers including amazon so if interested this book could be purchased online i hope you have uh, enjoyed listening to these wonderful concepts of fluid attenuated inversion recovery sequence the flar if you have really enjoyed it please share the link but please like my youtube channel dr srinivas medical concept which is india's leading neurology educational youtube channel so kindly subscribe to my youtube channel dr srinivas medical concepts and my web page dr srinivas concepts thank you bye